I copied the army composition of the Queen Walkers for my Clan War League attack. Welcome back to the channel then guys, I'm your host Juno Sloth. We need to get ready for our Clan War League attack. You know that I have enjoyed copying the number one players in the world, but for this one I wanted to copy the Queen Walkers. Firstly, they are one of my favourite teams and they did win the most recent Worlds Qualifier, getting the golden ticket to the final. And this was my favourite attack. It was by Stars. He used a Blizzard into Dragon Riders, but also had a clone spell for the balloons. It was so creative and that's why I want to copy it. Okay, so this is the base we are going to attack. I normally like to attack in towards the town hall, particularly in the clan war leagues, but it doesn't look great for the blizzard. So I think this compartment where the eagle is might be a better option. I have the composition from stars in front of me and the first thing we should do is boost the super troops. Now I know that he used the super wizards inside the battle blimp, but in terms of his super troops, he actually used the super war breaker, always handy for the clan war leagues, and the sneaky goblins. These are fantastic as well because they are great for funneling, making it easy to get your heroes where you want. I've written down exactly what he used, so let's stick that to the top of the iPad. One Lava Hound, six Balloons, two Archers, three Sneaky Goblins, two Wizards, 11 Minions. Very important for cleaning up after the Dragon Riders. Then for these spells, he used the five Invisibility, three Freeze, and a clone spell. Now we just have the clan castle. Looks like I requested a blizzard previously, but stars used the archers and a poison. Now I don't think we need the poison as part of this attack because the clan castle is right there, but I guess if we're truly copying, we need to request the exact army. Well, the army is ready, but I have never done this strategy before, and it is the Clan War Leagues, so I think I'm going to do one quick practice attack. Okay, this does not look too bad of a base to practice on, and it must be Fate. Stars. That's the name of the player we are copying. Hound. Blimp. Now, the first thing is getting the Blizzard correct, and I need to pop the Blimp. Oh, there's an E-Drag come out of the Clan Castle. Not what we need. Let's pop that. Let's rage. And it's invisible. Ooh, Super Wizards nearly got a shot from the scatter shot, but they're doing okay, taking out the core pretty well. Keep them invisible. One more. We've got one more. One more. Oh! Oh, we're not going to get the. Oh, that is so painful. Let's go like this. Maybe we can actually use the RC shield to get in there. Maybe I should have cloned the Super Wizards. Maybe that's what we could have done. And do we start the Dragon Riders? I guess we should. See if we can protect these heroes. Grand Warden on A. Uh, let's actually clone the loons. Let's do this. And let's send the Headhunters in. And now the Grand Warden ability. Okay, we've got one minute. And I didn't really see the top of the map. It could be a time fail if we are not careful. Let's get the minions in. Anything we can snipe off. Hmm, maybe we could get that cannon. We've still got a freeze. We've got the queen's ability. One minute. I think the practice attack has worked, but it's just a practice. What did we learn from that last attack? I think I used my invisibility too early. I'm always a bit scared that you have to use it before the super wizards come out, but I actually used it too early. So I think I lost a second of invisibility. Maybe that would have got the scatter shot, but either way, we got the three star and we're ready for the clan war league. No time like the present. Like I said, I do not want to fly into this bottom area. The sweeper is there. I could actually bypass the sweeper at the top and that would mean the lava hound can easily tank the air defense and I could get the Battle Blimp to this little pocket. That would give me access to the Scatter Shot, the Multi, and the Eagle Artillery. As an added bonus, the Royal Champion as well. Then in towards the Town Hall, I'm avoiding the Sweeper. Dragon Riders in, Archer Queen is there. Let's do this. We can figure the rest out as we go. <sighs> Stars, what have you done to me? The Clone Spell with the Blizzard. Here we go. 
Okay, we just need to get the blizzard right first. So let's zoom right in. And we need the lava hound to go to that air defense. Then I think probably the balloons. So let's go lava hound, two loons, battle blimp. Okay, looking good, looking good. We just need to get this invisibility spell down first. We cannot miss. So that's down. We pop the blimp. Let's rage. Let's do this. Multi is down already. That scatter shot cannot lock on. So normally I'd count to four, but I'm too distracted. Let's just get the invisibility spells in. Royal Champion is next on the hit list. And then, come on, get the scatter shot. Are they going through a wall? Woo! They just got it. Okay. And they're actually going to chain that Dark Elixir Storage. They get the Archer Tower. That's awesome. So let's start the funnel on the right. We've got a Lava Hound to deal with. So I think let's just let this balloon take out the cannon. Separate that funnel. Come on, hurry it up. There we go. Okay, we've got the one Ice Golem. I've got another. And I think if we set the funnel down the bottom here, just to allow the King and Queen to the Town Hall, that's what we need. So let's wait until this Lava Hound pops. Use the poison and get the other Ice golem in there we go and we need to break into this section looking good that first ice golem has popped and we've still got a long way to the town hall can we clone should we clone the ice golem i've got to think fast let's do it let's get two ice golems now stars used that for the balloons on the back end but i was a little bit worried about the town hall looks like the king would have got it anyway and, well, let's just go for it. Let's go with the Dragon Riders because we've got 1 minute and 30 seconds. You really don't want to wait much longer than that. Where do I use this Royal Champion? With the Dragon Riders? Oh, maybe to the left-hand side. Okay, so everything's looking good through that area. Grand Warden ability has been used with the Headhunters. Now we've got to get the minions in, but try and just snipe a little bit. What about these free spells? Grand... Oh, no, the Royal Champion. She's taking a lot of damage from the Expo. Let's just let her ability go off. I want the freezers for this air defense. I'm going to have to freeze the Expo. Dragon Riders are struggling with the four Expos. Let's freeze the air defense again because the Dragon Riders could be the savior. Come on, Royal Champion. Last troops are in to clean up the bottom. Oh, so he's going to get the air defense. But we are running short on the Dragon Riders. No! Oh, the Archer Tower didn't go down to the Royal Champion. Grand Warden, 30 seconds. Can he snipe it? We've got nothing else. The minions will take the king at the bottom. Come on, Grand Warden. That wizard tower needs to go down because of all of my minions. Here they come. 20 seconds. Do not tell me we're going to... Oh, hey, Skelly's a pop. Come off it. Come on. Wizard Tower falls. We can get the Archer Tower now as well. 10 seconds. 10 seconds. It's not going to work out. Oh, what's it going to be? You already got minions. Oh, no. It's a time fail. I cannot believe it. We were so close. Stars, you are a miracle worker. Maybe the clone on the ice golems wasn't worth it. But if you want to see when we copied the number one player in the Clan War Leagues, I have it on your screen alongside the subscribe button. I hope you enjoyed that either way. You guys take care and I will see you in the next video.